Hello everyone, Pally Tom here, and welcome back to RoboQuest! A very fast-paced, first-person shooter roguelite that we made our first impressions video for last week here on the channel. I've been playing it a bunch since then, both on stream and off stream at night with my friends, and I am still having an absolute blast. We were still trying to kill the level 2 boss as we started the run you're about to see, and I'm playing as the ranger. The character that's able to go into stealth as well as throw javelins as their abilities. I showed you how to unlock that class in our first impressions video as well. Now you're going to get to see me go far in a mission. I hope you guys enjoy today's video. If you do, please be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And I'll see you guys again very soon. What's the box going to give us? We have the sniper again, power fist, raptor SMG, or the flare gun. You know, I am curious. What does the flare gun do? Whoa! Whoa! A lot more explosive than I thought. It is a slow projectile, though. We'll see if we like it. Come on, buddy. Let's get you in there. Oh, I hate it. Oh, no. <laughs> it might be good versus the sentries in the back. Oh, I hate it. Oh, God. Oh, I hate it. All right, this is going to be awkward. We're going to need to swap this out really, really soon. Luckily, there's a purple door immediately on our left. I mean, I suppose I could use some javelins as well for the long range damage. Oh, nice. Nice. Okay. Into the room. Give me something. Was that necessary? I guess I'm gonna use grandma's shotgun. <laughs> I guess that's the game we're playing. This doesn't mean I'm gonna have to get very close to enemies, but theoretically, the reward could be worth it. Especially if it's gonna stun every time like that. Uh, that's gonna be a risky javelin throw. Oh, okay, so it still does do some moderate damage. Okay, that's not bad, that's not bad. I see we're using bird shot in Grandma's shotgun. That's not that bad. Hanzo arrow would alleviate some of my problems. Let's pick that up and see what our first perk is. Prestige security. While awareness is fully charged, increase armor. So that's if I don't take damage. Increases weapon and javelin damage against enemies within 7.5 meters. Ooh, all weapons, too. So I wouldn't even have to swap out. It's only when I'm close, but the shotgun's pretty good. I might try favorite weapon again. Keep the... Oh, look at the turret. Keep the bow, although I don't think I'm going to upgrade it. Can I get any better? Tommy gun would be good. Projectiles pierce, that's really good. Okay, our health is fine. Let's go to the Oasis. What is awareness? It's like this character builds up focus when they haven't been hit, but when they do get hit, it consumes all of the focus. So if you're, if you're like super good at dodging, it seems like that would be a good talent. Um, I am not. <laughs> I wouldn't even say I'm relatively good at dodging. Nice. Nice throw. Robot coming in on the rail. Might be able to get to it. That javelin pierced both targets. That was lucky. Don't want that explosive guy getting any closer. Uh, projectiles pierce. Nope. So do all heavy guns have that negative movement modifier with it? Stealthy. We'll just let that guy blow up on his own. One more behind me. It's a flyer. Oh, come on. There we go. We clipped it. We're good. Quick check of the map. We're moving in the right direction. I love to see that. Thing. Gonna grab all those region globes and reposition really hard. Wow, that decoy lasts a surprisingly long time. All right, there's our first S. We got it. Good. 
your brain doesn't work fast enough to remember to dodge. Yeah, I just kind of have this pattern I do. It's like I sway left and right. And that usually gets me through it. Increased javelin attack speed. Cr increased critical damage. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. What do we have from the box? Nothing I'm taking. Increase all damage against turrets. I will take that. Full healed. Increase all shock damage. 10 wrenches? That's so expensive. I mean, I'm going to take it, but that's so expensive. And an igniter gun. I think I'm going to leave that there. All right, sick. Let's move. Great start. We've got good momentum. S on the first area is easy. Can we get an S here too? Oh, I didn't hear the Luke Goblin in time, but that doesn't matter. I'm not missing any health. Good javelin. I do feel like when I get like really good crit builds going, like a scout sniper, one-shotting enemies, the uh, speed at which I move through a level just gets so much better. It's like instantly taking down targets is so valuable to me. It's the first time I've used the Tommy gun in a while. Okay. All right, that guy's gotta go. That guy's gotta fucking go. I almost got stunned again. Hold on, let's push. I gotta get this spawner out of here. Oh my God, there's several spawners. I also think I just aggroed the next room behind me. That's fun. I'm gonna go stealth. All right, we could jump on him as long as the spikes aren't there. But he does bring the spikes back. Great critical damage, beautiful. Uh, what do we have? This looks a little more accurate. It's an LMG. Ooh. Ooh, I love that sound. Ooh, that's snappy. How many bullets does it hold? 50? Uh, the piercing targets might be better. Let me go check what this weapon actually has on it. Uh, fire rage. Fires an explosive missile. It has missile blast. All right, all right, we'll, we'll see. I don't know if I've noticed the missile yet. Oh, it's an alternate fire. It's a right click. Ooh. Oh. Oh, I see the charge for it, I think. Down at the right side of the screen. Hey, just secured me some region gloves. Very nice. All right, you guys stay behind me. We're going this way. Uh, I might regret going this way, but we'll see. I do increase damage to sentries, right? Didn't we pick that up? So I should be able to one hit javelin those guys. Unless it was like weapon damage to sentry. I think dual LMGs are behind me on the map. I'm not gonna go back for those. Nice. Wow, the, the rocket essentially does the same amount of damage as a javelin. Oh no, I'm hacked. My controls are reversed. I'm going this way. I'm pressing right to go left. Just to break line of sight. Don't want to have that happen again? No, thank you. Great shot. It also stuns. Every time I shoot... Oh God. Every time I shoot the rocket, I find a new thing that I like about the rocket. Great throw. All right, we're going into the purple area. Although I don't need another gun. You never know, we might get something like super high level. Double kill! Rocket on the spawner in the back, taking that down. Very good. Looks like one sentry in front of the door. <laughs> I was gonna jump on its head. Uh-oh, uh-oh. These are explosive spawners and for some reason, I can't go invisible in here. Reduce armor by 12%. Taking damage grants a guaranteed critical hit. Wait a minute. Tommy gun coming back into my life. All right. You can take me away from the typewriter, but you can't take the typewriter out of me. Oh God. Uh, 
Where is that beam coming from? We need, oh, it's a squid. It's a slug in the back. I didn't see it. We got to get him down. I feel like I have to clear the entire room in order to reach him. <laughs> wow, the cryo slows down his animation so much. It made the jump slower. Like he was in the air for longer. He defied gravity longer because he was cold. <laughs> I didn't see that going. Well, we've cleared the whole map. We just need to zoom as fast as we can. Oh, I thought we cleared the whole map. I lied. Good. Quick reload. Stealth. I need those heals. Don't you rob me. I just learned you can slide. Look at that. Like Warframe. It's like a Warframe slide. How? Sprint crouch. Whoop! Good decoy got shot in the back immediately, though. It's like they realized I wasn't the decoy anymore, even though it was in play. Maybe I was just too close to them. All right, so far so good. We're not going to make that S-timer, probably. But I'm pretty happy with the progress we're making. <gasps> Increased fire rate and reload speed by 10%? Upgrade my Tommy gun. Thank you. Heal me. Thank you. And then while using stealth in for eight seconds after exiting it, increase fire rate and javelin attack speed by 25%. Marks an enemy hitting your decoy. Grants one additional javelin charge. Uh, I think after exiting stealth, that improved fire rate leans into what we're doing right now really, really well. What would really complement all of this is if I could somehow find a way. Wow. Wow, that damage is phenomenal. If I could find a way of also reducing my stealth time, I think we would be on easy street. This is a survival room again. Javelin through the eye. I'm just gonna keep doing circles around this room as best I can, grabbing my javelins and then chucking them at the next guy that I see. Most enemies will end up congregating in the middle and just kind of looking at you circle the outside, which I think makes surviving really easy. Uh, we are going to stealth here, though, really fast. Oh! Man, if I only had, like, bouncing projectiles, that critical ricochet or something. I know it wouldn't do a lot of damage, but could you imagine the AoE spread we would get going in stealth? Wow, that's so good. Uh, who's left? All right, see you later, little buddy. Nice throw, too. This is a green area, so we're almost done. Push! Ah! All right, we just have a boss to kill now. Increases headbox damage, increases weapon damage by 15% against enemies that are further away. Don't we already have a... Close one? No, I made that up. Full health. Sure, I'll take it. I don't know if I can even hit shots, really, with a gun with this much spread from that far away. Uh-oh. Dr. Turret! I think his weak spot is the cross. Oh, that doesn't look good. Got to double jump that or move to the outside of the room, maybe. Oh, and now he's putting fire on the ground. We got some pizza slice fire. Uh, jump. I'm going to play close to this pizza slice. Just in case he lays down another one. Oh, it went away. All right. Not bad. Hitting an enemy with javelin reduces stealth cooldown. An additional javelin or <laughs> increased javelin damage. Well, we did want a way of reducing our stealth cooldown, so it looks like throwing javelins is going to do it. Everyone we land takes one second off. That's, that's pretty meaningful. We just need to make sure we don't javelin before we enter stealth. We want to make sure that it's always helping reduce that cooldown. Oasis cleared! 
We have reached chapter two. The goal of this run is to kill a chapter two boss. If we do it, we unlock another character. So far, we're doing well. Uh, I might pick up the double power cell. Yeah, heal. Uh, while airborne, increase weapon damage. Every five seconds, perform a head bonk. No, no, no. Upgrade my Tommy gun, please. Thank you, sir. All right, deep breath. Here we go. Self, javelin, javelin. Do not sneak it up on me. There's a lot more movement in Act 2. Enemies have a lot more surprises up their sleeves. And we just need to make sure that we are mentally prepared for all of them. Good clear on the first room except for Sprinkler Boys. Oh, I knew they were there and they still got me! Decent healing's gonna heal up that chip damage though. Ooh, bad throw. Okay, hold on. Turret in the back. Good damage. I don't have javelins to throw. Man, our damage is ridiculous. Those weren't even crits. Fucking little sprinklers, dude. Come on, man. I, would, I don't want to lose to sprinkler chip damage. Do you have any idea how bad that would feel? Okay, we're going stealth now. Be very aggressive. Sprinkler. Did I get the single weapon perk again? I did. For the Tommy gun, and it is shredding. Previously, I've only tried the, the single weapon perk with... Careful. Oh, what a throw. I've only tried it with, like, uh, precision weapons. Well, not getting that guy. It still seems really good. I'm not, like, one-hitting these enemies like I'm used to, but we're shredding them fast. Like, that damage is still really meaningful. Nice. Okay, going for purple room, we may find an even better quick weapon. Who knows? Oh, you know what would be sick? That perk that gives us... Uh, we can continue to run around in stealth. Like, we could shoot and do stuff in stealth. That with our cooldown reduction for stealth, I think that could be incredible. Okay, we're missing about 60 HP at the moment. We might lose some more. What? Okay, never seen that one before. That was really hard. Uh, I'm gonna get the power cell and I'm leaving. Uh, left. <laughs> the stress of this run is getting to me. <laughs> I feel like I can't think. There's a lot of ums and uhs. Shit, that was a lot of damage. Are they generating a shield? Or is that part of my cryo freeze? That's part of my cryo freeze. All right, going stealth. Double javelin. God, that guy is terrifying. Javelin. Nice! Quick reload. Look how fast that reload is. Nice. Go, 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 go. Wait, is there more healing? Okay, last time, we, we went here in the video run for our first impressions video and, ooh, that's huge. Thank you. I wasn't able to open this door. I can't open this door now. So we can use the healing and we can keep the run alive. The Rhino LMG warm up 25% fire rate after shooting for one second. It also has another fire rate increase. Whew. Okay, now here's our stealth fire rate increase. That's a lot of bullets. That's a lot of bullets. I think we do that one. I think we do this. I think we do this one. We're 
sprinkler. Tim, like this game, we played it in early access together. We didn't get very far. Like, I don't think we ever killed a chapter two boss. Okay, headshots at long range are gonna be very difficult with this weapon, but they were also really difficult with the Tommy gun too, to be honest. I think I walked into that damage. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of just putting the crosshair on enemies and hoping that the damage connects. Increased weapon damage by 10%. Improved reload speed by another 15. Increases bestial ferocity armor. Uh, I think we just take the flat 10% damage increase, to be honest. Stealthing? He clipped me. He clipped me again. All right. All right. We're missing some health. No, not today. No. No, you stay in the dirt. I want to focus the... Oh, no. no. Good. I'm gonna get that healing. Nice. Nope. Nice. We're back in 300 health. Survival room. Oh shit. Hooks up. I don't want to lose in a survival room. Reload. Hug this corner. Maybe not too much longer. They can see through this smoke just fine, right? I'm the only one hindered by it. Jesus. I'm afraid to look at my health. I'm afraid to look at anything. Javelin, stealth. Oh, if I hit a javelin on two enemies, does that give me two seconds of CDR? God, that's so terrifying. Uh, we do have a... Oh, shit. Shit, I got clipped by that turret. I walked back into its projectile. That's gotta go. This warship's gotta go, dude. This fucking warship's gotta go, dude. Good damage. All right, let's hope there's some healing behind this door. <laughs> B on time. Oh no, I slowed down so much. Oh no. All right. So is the boss at the end here? Or is it one more level and then the chapter two boss? One time, thank you for the 34 months. In the robo future, bushes are made out of adamantium. 25% uh, critical damage after dealing a critical hit. Magazine size and first shot damage. That's four power cells if we want to try that. Can't buy anything there. Could upgrade our gun. What level of weapon is that? It's a level seven. That's cheaper than upgrading our gun. Increased melee and javelin damage. I'm gonna take the power cell, take the health. I'm gonna take this gun. Oh, oh, it's like the best of both worlds. 
I kind of feel bad I didn't know he was a target dummy. I just started shooting. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we like this. If not, we're leaving our gun behind. I hope we don't regret it. <sighs> do not regret it. I do not regret it. That is snappy. That is good. That is really good. Okay, let's go. Huge. What's my perk? Uh, using stealth generates six charges. Yes, we're getting true shot. We're getting true shot. We're getting true shot. Yes. Chat, where were you? Where were you for the run, chat? <laughs> I like how just making it to the second boss is the definition of the run for me. <laughs> Very good. Very good. All right, let's see how bad this is. We can do this. Whoop. Okay, missed that one. Uh, junk rifle, definitely not taking that. We'll take the power cell. Going straight from here. Look how short of a path that was. You gotta kill that guy quick. Falling back. I still don't know what the shtick is with that. Wait, we we all saw that, right? He just flew through the floor. Uh, Tim? I'd like to report a bug. No fucking way. Uh... No, 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 It's got to be a debate. There's, it's got to be a debate. There's no way. Shit. I can't. I can't talk. So I'm not going to. <laughs> That was good. That was good. Oh my God. All right, North. We have great cover here. I feel like when I have cover, I'm a lot more confident. Who would have guessed that? I saw that stealth guy. We're getting better, dude. We're getting the vision. We're getting the vision. All right, checkpoint. I probably won't be able to heal here. Oh, thank you. I was thinking they were going to do the same thing to me where it was like, you got to have this biome key to go that way. I don't want that shotgun. Thank you, my dude. Okay. Okay. Well, here goes nothing. We're full health. We're doing really, really well. Is that a bow? I just don't think I swap. This weapon is excellent. I am going to need to make up that chip damage. I didn't even look at it, you see that? I have the weapon. I have the weapon for the run. Oh! 
Well, I missed out on the loot goblin, I think. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. What's my upgrade? True shot maximum damage. Oh, maximum charges. Uh, take down your javelin charge. Okay, we'll do the augment. So we have eight charges when we come out of stealth now for that increased damage. I love that upgrade. That upgrade's good. For this kind of play style, anyway. Here. Stealth. Especially good if I don't miss all of the shots on a target that's not moving on a fucking stationary target. Survival room. Focus up. <laughs> No! I lost half my health! I decoyed that perfect time. Oh, God. There's nothing in this room! There's no cover! There's fucking nothing! No, you don't. I see you chasing me. I see you chasing me. Where'd you go? Where'd you go, stealth boy? No, 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 no. Ah! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I just stressed open the monster that I just had on my desk, you know, just in case you need a monster. It's been sitting here for a week. I just broke the seal on it. I'm not losing. I'm getting that boss. God damn it. I'm getting that boss. Okay. All right. Health is really bad. <laughs> We're gonna have to do a lot of healing to get back in this game. It's gonna have to be a lot of healing, but we can do it. We have the setup. We have every advantage. Stealth and grab these, and then I'm going back. I'm going back to my corner. <laughs> Where are you? Okay, okay. Good, good healing, good healing, good healing, good healing, good healing. Next room. That guy's gotta go. That electricity thing's gotta go. Ah! I didn't know they could move like that. Yes, I did. I didn't know that, I didn't know that. Okay, good room, good room, good room, good room. We're back up to 200. Good room. No! He was invisible! Ah! Back below 200. We have. Oh, we have a heal. We have a heal. We have a heal. We have a heal. This is boss. This is boss. Increase freeze rate. I don't freeze. And duration. I yeah, I don't freeze. Chat. I've never seen the level two boss. I have never seen it. I. And presumably there's a bunch of variations for this too. I'm gonna pick up this damage return thing because I'm assuming I'm about to take a lot of damage. Oh no. The judge ball? Oh, I'm stealthing? 
Um. <laughs> Wait, I don't think it can turn around. Wait a minute. What's that? What are you? Oh! It's just going for my decoy nonstop when I do that. I'm pushing, I'm pushing, I'm pushing, I'm pushing, 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 pushing. Ah! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah, dude! That was the objective. We unlocked it. That is the first purple weapon I have ever seen. That's six. Six of our fuel cells. I don't know, dude. Our weapon's kind of fucking owning. I don't know, dude. Let me grab this power cell. I'm going to upgrade our weapon twice, make it level nine. Spend at least 40 power cells in a single run. We did it. The secret's got to be up here. This looks like a secret to me. It's not a secret. <sighs> All right, chat. What are these symbols at the top of the screen right now? Like a, like a warship, two slugs and a dude. Let's look at our upgrade before we move forward. Take it down an enemy, increase elemental damage. I guess I'll just do Hocus Pocus. Hey bud, you on the roof? Oh, he had a shield. Oh my God, that's like an artillery strike in the middle there. Oh, those guys are hard to spot. They're like on the top of... Yeah, they're right there on each of the buildings. That's hard to spot. They don't have the glowing red eye like the other... <gasps> Look at the mini-map. Look at the mini-map. We have some high-value targets here. That's what those icons mean. Ugh. Come here. I'm just going to take my time. The, the experience rating is out the window. Ouch. Something hit me from behind. Uh. Oh, uh, what the fuck was that? Okay, slugs have new moves. That's my only way forward. Oh boy. Stunned in the beam. You dirty little shit! Ah! Okay, so that's one of the slugs down. All right. The sprinklers everywhere is really hard. I don't think I have a key to open that direction to the left, so I'm not even gonna go there. I guess we're just heading to the next big target down the street here. Half health. It doesn't seem like the variance is too high yet for like the types of combat these enemies are doing. Like it's the same as, as area two, except we have these like building turrets added in. The, the combat tactics change from chapter one to chapter two is really, really big. And I was worried that I was about to be extremely humbled. Well, I mean, there's still time for that. <laughs> still a lot of time for that. Uh, okay. Our big airship guy is on the other side of this wall. I do have two avenues for attack, at least, it looks like. Although this is spawning the next area. I have to clear this out now. And then I might be able to jump over that ridge. That little, um, grass thing, that shrubbery thing. I see you. I don't even think they show up on the mini map right away until you have direct line of sight of the the, the building turrets. Stop. I 
Just shooting text. Thank you. I still got it sometimes. Whoa, look at this. <gasps> Whoa. Where's this taking me? Oh. Go back. <laughs> I never would have thought that would have been my solution to taking down a warship. That's another artillery strike. Turret. Okay, we gotta go south. Can I get back up there? How did I... <laughs> How did I do that in the first place? <laughs> I don't remember. Okay, we're going to the ground. That's okay. got a perk uh instantly executes enemies with less than 15 percent remaining health and bosses with less than four javelin marks targets for an explosion or your decoy shoots enemies dealing damage exiting stealth deploys another decoy that sounds fun this one flying over you walking okay this one's got to be flying right yep Wow. Wow. I shot his eyeball that accurately. Wow. That means that there's literally no recoil on this weapon. It resets down to base every time. This weapon is insanely good, dude. My health is not. My health is not insanely good. Uh, this way. This is a really cool level. It seems like you can approach this in a ton of different ways. And you get to pick the order that you fight the challenging enemies in. I really like this. Like I said, I've never made it that far or this far. So all of this is brand new to me. Let's try to get these globes before they despawn. And it looks like whoever we're after is... Uh, <laughs> whoever we're after is... Just in stuff. Okay. Nice and easy. He's got a little guy on his back. I didn't know I could do that. I also can't tell where his weak spot is. Oh God, no! Oh God, no, no, no! Go for my decoys, son of a bitch! Oh, sh oh shit! Oh God! Oh, that was good. Yes! How do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Oh, it's like southeast, maybe. That's a level 10 Tommy gun. I still don't think we swap. Oh, me, oh my. We're not out of this yet. Don't get complacent. <laughs> All right, we're out of it now. <laughs> I could have killed those guys and got an S. I don't, oh, I should have. 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 That's okay. Dual Hellions. Damn. Level 11 on our weapon. Look at this. It is, looks similar. It's two icons up at the top. I, I don't even recognize those icons. 
Uh, Rhino LMG. I'm going to take another one of these. Can I upgrade again? Thank you. Level 12. Well. We've already done better than I thought. I mean... That's a solid beam. Hello, hello, hello. Oh my God, they have landmines now. Did you see that? Did you see that? Oh, and this guy has spikes on him. You can't jump on that turret. <laughs> That's funny. Upgrade, choose an element. Your decoy deals that element. Or reduce the stealth cooldown. No, we have decoys that shoot and extra decoys. We're going to take, we're gonna take freeze. We're gonna try to slow these guys down a little bit with our decoys, make our shots easier. So we're adding in a little bit of crowd control with each decoy now too. Still, no! Oh, still no idea where I have to go. Didn't even see that, whatever hit me. I don't know if there. If I can't find another place to heal, dude, I'm screwed. I shouldn't say that. It's just gonna be an uphill battle. Doable. Always doable. Oh, is this one of the doors? <gasps> Catblog, thank you so much for the 19 months. Welcome back. Happy to have you. Thank you so much for supporting the content, my dude. I do like being up here a lot more. Than down there for obvious reasons. But this also means I'm really, really far away from any healing we might get. No, we're okay. There's still two more things in this room that I don't see. Oh, one. Oh God, that's getting really hard. Come on. I'm literally jumping at shadows, but that's because some of the enemies are shadows. What is... What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, increase critical damage by 40%, but decreases regular damage. No, we'll take power cell, we'll leave. Oh, I thought that light on top was the crit spot. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, okay. Oh my god. I need health so bad. I still don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, I see, I cleared one of the purple areas. Okay, and that was enough. All right, so pres presumably there's another purple area on the other side.
Gobble, 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 gobble. All right, we're going east. 174 HP. I'm gonna play so fucking cautious. But we still need to move up. We're just gonna decoy, grab my Oh my god! Oh, I almost walked straight in. Increased decoy duration by 1.5 seconds. Increased fire rate. Let's do decoy duration. It looks like it said it's also gonna make them taunt more. Which sounds awesome. Purple gun. Dual Uzis. We're leaving it there. We can only wield one weapon. So if we put both decoys out like that, effectively, we're doing damage around the corner. I got so lucky there. I don't know what made me look that way. We're dealing really good damage around the corner and slowing down enemies at the same time. Dead end, but I think I can use the dead end. Wow, what a great concept. That didn't feel bad that I went the wrong way there. It gave me a new way. Awesome. I'm really enjoying the level design here. Oh no. I feel like I have every advantage up here too. All right, Purple Door, what do you got for me? 212 health. Oh. Okay. The secret is to not look at the whole map at once. Just deal with what's directly affecting me. Now where? That north road. I see it. Oh, that's it. Right there. That's it. Okay. Hey. Hi. Hello. Oh, man. You know, we had so many upgrades, we could have made this healing more effective. And I was like, I'm healing up to full every time. Increases reload speed by 20% when clip is empty. Increases non-elemental damage by 10%. Okay, so chat, is this last boss or chapter three boss? Is there more bosses after this boss? Okay, deep breath, here we go. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna decoy immediately. Oh, the floor is lava. Okay. Oh, I can't go that way. Wait, how do I get up there then? Wait. No, no, no. Not like this. Not like this. <laughs> no! Oh, it was so close, dude. It was so close, dude. No. Best run I've ever had. Unlocked a new character, killed stuff I've never seen before, made it to a new area I've never seen before. That was an excellent run. 
I just didn't know the floor was going to turn into lava. We could have had that. Oh, man. Oh, man. 41 wrenches. Cheers. Wow. What do we want? Ooh, premium chest. Increases maximum health by five when leveling up. Contains one additional choice. And they have a chance of being higher quality. That one seems excellent. Chef Paul can now reroll affixes. <gasps> Bizarre Bob provides one additional item. Let's do the health. And we'll start working on that stuff. Great one. I really feel really good about that. That was awesome.